Hormones such as cortisol and cortisone are released from the middle layer of the adrenal cortex. They affect glucose levels in the blood, they are anti-inflammatory, and they mediate many aspects of the stress response. They affect cells because cells can express one of two receptors, mineral corticoid uh, receptors and glucocorticoid receptors. These glucocorticoid hormones can bind to both. And so cells can be affected by glucocorticoids by expressing either of these two hormone receptors. Now, not all people express the same variant of these two receptors. And uh, MR and GR polymorphisms or variants have been associated with differences in stress responses and the ability to cope with stress. Glucocorticoids mediate many of the aspects of the stress response, including many aspects which are problematic when glucocorticoids are released chronically and at high levels. For example, regions of the brain express receptors for the glucocorticoids, such as the hippocampus, amygdala, and prefrontal cortex. And when high levels of glucocorticoids are released chronically, this will increase the levels of nerve cell death in these areas and decrease the rate at which new nerve cells are generated. Altered levels of glucocorticoids then can lead to mood and behavioral changes and have been linked to depression, post-traumatic stress disorder, and the feeling of burnout. 